guys, I got most of my Christmas stuff done. I thought I'd show it to you. Here's my little Christmas towels that I have hanging on my oven door. And up here I have my pot holders. Those are from Jen from last year. And my spoon rest that was a gift last year. And over here is my little soap dispenser. I turned it on. It lights up. LED lights. They're kind of bright. So... I don't know if I can, there we go, shut it off. But anyway, there's the soap dispenser and a towel. And I have my coffee cup. I do have a coffee cup. I already had that, actually. So I'm getting ready to have some fresh coffee right now. Let me go out and show you the tree here. So I'll show you some stuff in my living room. Here's a Santa Claus that was made by, um, I can't remember who made it. My grandma used to have a craft shop. So somebody in my family made it. I think it was my uncle's wife. So, there's the Santa Claus, and over here, my shelf. I hope you can see it okay. There's not much light in here. This snowman up here was my grandma's. A lot of this stuff was grandma's, and uh, just some little things there, little decorations. I don't have anything fancy. I'm very sentimental, so a lot of my stuff is really old. Um, let me come over here really quick and turn the light on. I'll show you that stuff over there in the corner might help. Here's this stuff over here in the corner. We like blue and green lights. And that snowman used to be my grandma's. Donna, Mike, can you even see that? There's not enough light, is there? Let's take you over here in the light. <laughs> yeah, a little Steeler's house. While I'm over here, I'll show you this. My grandma made that. It's, just, it's a Christmas card. It says Merry Christmas on it. And that is, it's called Artex or Trichem paints that you use for fabric. And one of my kids made the soldier with the Pringles can. So, like I said, I'm sentimental. I keep everything. There's my stuff I have up in the window. The patriotic Santa Claus. That uh, Christmas tree right there was bought from my grandma's craft shop also. She bought that for me for a gift because I told her I loved it and I did and I've had that since I was a teenager. So that's vintage. And let me just show you. Gosh, I'm trying to climb up on the couch. <laughs> Santa Claus. Hold on. Hold on. He winds up in the back and plays a patriotic song. I don't know what the song is though. So yeah. Now that he's playing. This guy here, he turns on and plays Christmas music too. Yeah, so there you go. Here's some little things I have sitting in front of the TV. There's my bears that say Noel, and I get a little upset with my boys just about every year because they always switch it around and make it say Leon. So, yeah, I always have to check those. These trains say my three oldest kids' names on them. Josh, Brooke, and Courtney. There's a little cracker barrel. <laughs> oh, hopefully I'm not covering up the microphone because I really don't know where it is. Got this guy sitting around my lamp. And here's my tree. It takes me a while to do my tree because I wrap all the branches with lights and... I do the icicles, and I have a lot of old ornaments, stuff the kids made, as you can see. <laughs> of course, we have candy canes. And there's another handmade kid ornament there. <laughs> there's a big Santa Claus that one of the kids made back there, too. See him? Out of tongue depressors. It's got my kids' names on it. My aunt buys those. For the kids. That says Brendan. I don't know if you can see it with the glare. Where's Hayden's? Oh, he put his own on, so it's way down here. There's Hayden's in there. I don't even know if you can see it. But anyway. Oh, here's a special one. This is my autographed Bo Bice ornament. I went to one of his Christmas parties in Nashville, and he autographed an ornament for everybody that was there. <laughs> kind of cool, huh? I think so. Here's me and John's wedding picture on an ornament. <laughs> and I just knocked it down so that's okay but this is my tree we like icicles 
So there's my tree. And I can't, couldn't find my tree topper this year. It's a star that lights up. And John mentioned, I think he's right. I think we threw it away last year because it quit working. So you see the big Steelers banner back there on the wall? Yeah. And the archway, I always do the tinsel garland with the um, mistletoe ball there above the chair. I'm sure Chase will have his little girlfriend over here, have her sitting in that chair. <laughs> oh, and i got to show you this. Here's a wreath. It's a rag wreath, and I made that a few years ago. So that's my brother's family. <laughs> and my kids. Here's all my kids, Josh, Brooke, Courtney, these pictures are old, Chase, and Brandon, yeah. So anyway, here's my little Santa Claus pillow. This is where I put my cards and my dog leashes. I have to keep those back there in the basket so everybody puts them away where they go. And here is the plate that has ornaments on it right now, but that's cookies for Santa. So Christmas Eve, there'll be cookies on there. Okay, let's come over here. Woo, dizzy. Up here is books that Hayden and I will be reading. The Red Night Before Christmas one is actually his. I got that for him for his first Christmas. So, and I've got some Christmas books inside the bookcase too. And this is Hayden's toy area. Star Wars stuff. This is... A reindeer that my grandpa got for I think he got it for Chase and it was grandpa's last Christmas with us and he was in the nursing home with Alzheimer's and he bought that for Chase and Chase is the only one he bought for and that's fine I thought it was cute that's grandpa and this is an old picture of grandma and that's grandma too you see that and this is this is my doggy bow Yep. We had him cremated. He got hit by a car. He was my baby. I loved him. So, okay. Um, I think that's everything. I think that's all I wanted to show you. One more shot of the tree. I think it's so pretty. <laughs> all right. That's it. See ya.